Hi, I'm a final year student at Harry Watt University in Edinburgh, UK. I've studied digital signal processing and carried out lab experiments using one of these. This is a TI DSP development kit, but look at this. This is the TI Tiva launchpad. It's a very inexpensive development kit for TI's ARM Cortex M4 microcontroller. It has many applications, but what's really cool is that the ARM Cortex N4 is a DSP enhanced microcontroller. To do real time DSP experiments, you want one of these. This is an audio booster pack from Circuit Code. Basically, what we have here has a high quality audio codec and has line in, line out, mic in, and headphone out. We also have oscilloscope test points. We can run at sampling rates of 8 kHz to 48 kHz. It connects easily to the launch pad, just like this. In lectures, we've learned the theory of FIR filters, and here's an example of an FIR filter designed using MATLAB. We can export the filter coefficients from MATLAB to a header file for a program running on the launchpad. Okay, so this is MDK ARM, the development environment for C programs running on the launchpad. It's easy to download and it's free. You could develop your own programs from scratch, or you can download lots of examples from the website from this book. What we have here is a program implementing the filter we designed in MATLAB. The launchpad and booster pack are currently connected by USB. We have downloaded the program to the launchpad and I will now run it. This is a virtual oscilloscope and spectrum analyzer. We are feeding pseudorandom white noise into the filter and what we can see here is the output from the filter, which is bandpass filtered noise. You can also hear the bandpass filtered noise. So this is a quick and easy representation of what the filter is doing. One cool feature is that the program is now stored in flash and will run on power up. That was just one example, but there are 65 different examples in this book. And this is just the starting point. To do these real time DSP experiments, you want the Tiva launch pad and the Circuit Co audio booster pack. It's really easy to set up and it's very inexpensive.